four lions belong to one of three great kingdoms. The Moon Kingdom, the Sun Kingdom, and the Storm Kingdom. The Storm Kingdom was favored by Kansu, the Wanderer, goddess of travels, wisdom, and rain. The Sun Kingdom was blessed by Suns, the Trickster, goddess of wrath, life, and the sun. Her eye watches as long as the day is light. The Moon Kingdom was blessed by Azra, the Guardian, Sansa's blind twin sister and goddess of mercy, death, and the moon. Once per generation, each great kingdom had a leader divinely chosen by their goddess. This chosen lion ruled their kingdom until the next chosen came of age. Ugh, all this lead up is boring. Get to the part about Kyoga and her one true love. I don't hear about light, and I kicked Karabi the Terrible's butt and saved the world. Spark, that's not how it happened at all. Do you ever listen? Enough. If you don't settle down, I won't tell you the story again at all. Yes, yes grandmother. grandmother. Now, this chosen lion of the Sun Kingdom, Light. Light and Kyoga fell deeply in love. Both kingdoms eagerly awaited their bonding day and the peace which would follow. And look sad. What? That's not fair. Kyoga doesn't do anything. That's exactly why you're her. Dad, Spark's being a jerk again. I'm lost. What are you arguing about? You don't know the story? I'm fuzzy on the details. Light loved Kyoga, but then she got kidnapped, and everyone died, and now we have prides. Even I know that wasn't right. Karabi kidnapped Kyoga and took her far away from Light. It started a huge war between the kingdoms and Light vowed to save her. When he had finally found them, Karabi had already killed Kyoga. Light vowed to avenge her. He and Karabi battled for days, but Light had the power of love on his side, and he was finally able to defeat her. The war ended after that, but the kingdoms were too broken to fix. So Light created Prime Law so everyone could be happy again. That's why we live in Prides today! That's a pretty violent story for you cubs. I should have a talk with Sharp Tongue about that. I love Her Sharp Tongue stories! stories. Are the best. I don't like them either, Dad. You don't count. You don't like anything. I, I like things. I just like real things. Not stories. Like Mom says. Real things are fun too. Let's play main and no main fire. Rawr! I said real things? Lionesses are too weak to be main. The main of this pride is old and slow. He had his time as main, and now it's mine. The only problem is that he's huge. Last time I challenged him, I got this to show for it. I'm not giving up, though. But I'd love a little backup in case he gets me in a tough spot again. Sister, Feather, would you mind coming along to help? You'll have a place in the pride as long as I'm main, of course. Her name is nothing. Sir. The main should be coming by here soon. Do you know what to do? I'll stay hidden, and if you need any help, I'll come out on your signal. No man! I can smell you! Come out! That's my cue. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> Sister! Help! Sister! I'll kill you! <laughs> Nomain didn't find me. What about Spark? But you're still here. That's what counts. Come on, let's go tell Mom. Sister, what's wrong? It, it's my leg. It hurts when I step on this one. Do you need help? N no, I'm okay. It doesn't hurt if I don't put any pressure on it. Okay, come on. We should just kill him! 
He's a pathetic, spineless, weak, half-blind joke of a mane! But I won the battle with Starmane honorably. I swear, it was that cub. The female. There's something wrong with that one. It said something evil before it attacked me. Like it was possessed. She is my cub. And you will not refer to her as it. Pride law is not so simple as to allow us to just kill him, Power Strike. While I agree he is in the main I would have chosen, he defeated Starmane in fair combat. He was bested by a cub, mother. The pride is rightfully his. <laughs> so you think I should just let him kill my other two cubs because he says he defeated Starmane fairly? I did. Quiet! I'm not saying you should let him do anything to them. My decision as Hans Chief is to have them coexist. Coexist? He bested Starmane in combat, and so the pride rightfully belongs to him. Your daughter then bested him in combat, which proves that she and Fire have a right to the pride as well. So, let them both have it. Ugh, that'll never work. How could we ever trust him alone with them? If it was the will of the three sisters for them to die, they would already be dead. If you harm these cubs, you will earn the ire of the goddesses themselves. How do you know the goddesses are involved? I see things you cannot. I know. You expect my cubs to be protected by nothing more than superstition? He'll never keep his word. <laughs>